Hey, Brad. Hi, Ben. Hey, thanks for joining me here on this couch. Um, it's great to virtually be here. Shh, no, dude. They no? Think we're, they think we're on the same couch. Oh, right okay. Now. All right, let's start over. Oh, don't shoot me. No, you don't have to start over. This is this is all great. Bang. Uh, Whichever the, side. Yeah, there, no, yeah, yeah, <laughs> there you go. That's it. Yep. Uh, Brad, you're over there across am, the room. I'm in space. In space. I'm Captain Virtual Reality. Brad, can you take me to space? Let's go to space. Let's go to space. Let's go to space. We're in space now. I'm in my, I'm in my space habitat here. What is this? Uh, for, this is Farpoint. This is a new first person shooter for PlayStation VR. Uh, it comes with this snazzy peripheral. It's cool because you're looking at your gun in real life and I am. in the game. I am. Check this out. Look. I'm moving a thing and it's moving. Uh, this, this thing is weird. This thing is like an entire uh, DualShock 4 in gun configuration. Like, I, I, which way's the camera? <laughs> uh, yeah, that way. Uh, so it's probably hard to see on the feed, but like there's a D-pad here, there's two sticks, there's the face buttons, uh, there's all the, all the triggers are the uh, shoulder buttons. It's got like 100% of the buttons of a DualShock 4 on this controller. Uh, it's kind of neat. Uh, you wanna go shoot some space bugs? Yeah. Whoop, I knocked over the coffee pot. Wait, <laughs> knock is, over the rest of the stuff. Hang on, is that a coffee pot or a scientific instrument? Uh, I mean, those is, are the is same there a difference? Yeah. yeah. Whatever. Uh, 80 bucks, right, for this whole package? Uh, yeah, so yeah, it's 80 bucks for the game and uh, this controller. I think the game is 50 by itself. Yes. I think you could also play it with a uh, move, maybe also just the dual shock. Uh, let's just jump into the story. I'm like three missions in. I think this is, or I finished three missions. This is the fourth one. Okay. Uh, there might be some light spoilers. There's no uh, chapter select in this, so I just have to pick up Brad, where I was. You need to yeah, be was... careful with your desk. Ah, you know, it's the magic of virtual reality. It'll, it'll come back. What is this thing? Um, it's like a tape It's recorder? like a space tape recorder. Hmm. What's going on out here? It's a pretty good view. Space herb. <laughs> Only the finest space it's herb space on this plant. station. Yeah. It's legal in space. It is. These are international waters. Yes. Your shitty earth laws don't apply here. All right, let's go shoot some space bugs. How is it, how is virtual reality treating you? That's all right, it's okay. I don't know, I've gotten mildly motion sick every time I've played this game. <laughs> you know, it's a little, little sickening to watch out of VR yeah, too, Yeah, it, so. it can be that way. I'll try to keep my head movements as steady as I can. So the, the look uh, controls, or the turning controls in this game are probably the weirdest thing about it. Uh, so yeah, also, yeah, hey, let's check it out. Wee, uh, wee. Uh, so it defaults to this. Uh, it defaults to no turn, which means I literally cannot turn. <laughs> like, this is all I can do. This is the default control scheme. Like, I'm, I'm moving the looks, the stick, and nothing's happening. So, like, they determined this was the default way that people should play this game. That's weird, right? Yes. I'm so lonely. You're back. I'm back from, I went to Earth for a second. <laughs> teleported down for a hot second. Uh, yeah, so like, I, it's, it's the weirdest thing. Like, I, like, being able to, like, playing a shooter where you cannot turn yeah. at all. Well, I mean, it's like tank controls, right? Kinda, like, worse yeah. tank controls? Yeah, like, I'm, I'm, I'm basically, I can just move like this and just sort of look around. So like, if I want to see what's behind me, I can do this. It's, it's an odd setup. I mean, but they, have, the tons of, they have tons of options, though. Do the enemies often get behind you, or...? Uh, they definitely... I'm getting to the point where the, the areas, the, like, the combat arenas are kind of opening up a little bit, and yeah, they totally will. Um, so, Smooth is full-on first-person shooter. Like, like, you can just full-on turn as you would expect. This is, like, instant motion sickness for me, though. <laughs> like, I don't know how this plays outside the headset, but, like, I'm already getting kind of swimmy-headed. Whoop. That's a big bug. It is a big bug. Uh, so I've been playing the I've been playing the game pretty much exclusively like this so far, but I can pretty much only play it like one level at a time, and then I have to turn it off. Whoop! Ah! So are you you're trying to rescue your former teammates, or did you go up with them, or are you uh, chasing them? You were on your way. Hang on, let me just shoot my way out of this mess. Sure. Bugs. Whoa! God, that thing's big. You got it though. I don't know. I don't know how that looks on the TV, but like that giant thing flying right in your face looks fucking awesome. 
Like it's it's really crazy uh, to have just like a, a monster, like an object that big, just come flying straight at your face. Yeah, I'm totally dead. Oh, yeah, you got right. too much of that strawberry jam on yep, you. Yep, I totally did. All right. Uh, so, I just started experimenting with. Uh, so. Basically, it's got the VR thing of like these kind of these like staggered, uh, uh, like kind of movement at an interval. Which I guess I guess this is like the actual right way to put uh, to put look on a stick in VR. Oh man! Yeah, that <laughs> it feels like I've been hitting that spacer. <laughs> uh, that that might look terrible on a TV, but it, like it makes me less sick. Like it's 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 a little bit easier on your stomach. I can confirm that it looks terrible on a TV. Yeah, I mean it doesn't look great in here, but like <laughs> it, but it but it keeps you from getting that instant queasiness. Yeah, and it seems like it's necessary for when you start to get overwhelmed, just having that reliable turn. Yep, totally. You like my there shotgun? There we go. Oh, shoot its underbelly for maximum damage. Totally did. Uh, so, so far I've only got this assault rifle and a shotgun. Whoa. Hello. Can you kill those? Oh, uh, yeah, you can. Oh. Okay. Nice. What's the ammo situation like? Uh, it's all unlimited. The, uh, woo. Let me get out of this mess and I'll show you. That guy's mad. Boom. Oh, now he's real mad. He's about to be dead. Fuck you. <laughs> Those guys take a lot of hits. Oh! All right. All right, I think we're safe. Yeah. Nice. Got it. Uh, so, yeah, so the um, assault rifle has like a heat meter, kind of an overheat uh, thing going on. You see that meter filling up? Oh, yep. Yeah, so, so that thing is unlimited ammo just with uh, overheat. Uh, and then you can just dump with the shotgun, and then you have to reload shell by shell on this thing. So I'm just hitting the reload button as fast as I can. Uh, so yeah, you, uh, you're on your way to a space station where these two researchers are hanging out studying a wormhole. Uh, and as you arrive, the wormhole explodes. Oh. And then everybody ends up on this planet, and I'm trying to find those guys now. Hello. Can you walk past them? Peekaboo. Ah! <laughs> he didn't want to fight, Brad. No, but he was kind of in my way. Ew! Oh. Ew! Oh. Ah. oh! Looks like my lunch. Ugh. That's disgusting. It was okay. What the hell is that? Oh boy. Whoa! Okay, that's new. I haven't seen that before. Don't get scanned, is my advice. Yeah, I better not. I mean, I've got my own scanner. Okay. What does that do? Uh, you'll probably see pretty shortly. It's easier to just explain it when I get to a place where I can use it. Uh, this, this game's kind of cool. It's like as simple as can be, though. Like, level design is 100% linear. Move forward, yeah. shoot aliens, it is, it, is, it, it is absolutely just move from canyon to canyon and, and shoot a bunch of bugs. I mean, they uh, gotta nail this formula for yeah, VR. Yeah, totally, totally. They're literally still trying to figure out how a first-person shooter should even work, right? In VR. Yeah. Did I kill that thing? Uh, I don't know. Only if it swoops back around towards you. Yeah. Maybe hide behind those, like, shields. I'll say if the, if the scanny stuff turns red, I'm gonna say it's safe to shoot. Whoa! Is that Holy a, crap! Uh, That's new. Is that your ship? Uh, maybe? I doubt it. Jeez, all right. I bet that looks pretty cool in VR. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, like every, everything about this game is pretty simple and straightforward from the action to the story, but it's all executed pretty well. Oh, no. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I see red lights. Yeah. No. Oh, do it. Oh, no. Oh, God. Hang on, I gotta hold my gun in Call of Duty position. That's right. 
to observe proper protocol. You gotta do the like, I like how it's positioned just kind of right in the middle, a la original Doom, just guns. Just like this? Yeah. Just run around like this yeah, all the time? Yeah. Whoa, are they fighting each other? Yeah. yeah. Oh, the robots don't like the, Dude, I love the it. space bugs. Love it when the enemies fight. It's good. It's the best. Because then you kind of like start to figure out who the winner is going to be, yeah. and then even the tide a little bit. I, I think, think those robots I are going to win. I think the robots are going to take this one. Yeah. Whoop. Well, hang on. Yeah. Little creepy crawlies are coming out. Wow. Oh no. That was kind of cool. We were fooled. Uh oh. Whoop. Nice. Ah. Nice. That robot's like, job's done. Nope. Seems to be a little generous with the auto-aim from far away. Oh, I don't know. You it kind of snapped a little bit. Maybe, I don't know, maybe, maybe you're just impeccable. Maybe, maybe my aim's just that good. Yeah. Uh, it's kind of awesome holding like a physical thing and having it map one-to-one. -one. Yeah. Because like you don't really think about aiming, right? You just kind of do it. To assist holographic file recovery, please locate and scan all fragments. So this is what the scanner is for. Oh, it's for scanning fragments. Whoa. Grant, are you seeing this? Yeah, but I don't believe it. There's no way this is from the pilgrim. <gasps> Even maybe you should get out of there. No. Ah. No, I'm going to find it. No! no. <laughs> you didn't. Personal space. It said scan, not yeah, it's not hover. Yes. Cass, scan for human remains. Scanning. Where is everybody? Scan complete. No results found. Hi, hello. This area looks fairly open. Uh, yeah, like I said, the combat areas have started, like it starts out like literally funneling you through canyons constantly, but, right. yeah, but it's it started opening up a little bit. Uh, also, like I said, I just switched to this kind of like stuttery turning method right before this quick look, but I'm gonna say that's totally the way to play this game. Because I feel way less queasy than I have so far. I think they should just re release movies for VR, but let you kind of be the main character and hold the gun. Because imagine if this was actually just Starship Troopers. Oh, dude, yeah. Is this a thing? Can you scan it? No, they only let you scan those holograms so far. Whoa. Oh. All right, let's move on. It's weird that you have to wear ah. the helmet, but there's obviously oxygen on this planet because there's fires burning. Yes. Uh, they actually address that. Ah, at the beginning of this. Now I'm an idiot. Dude, there's totally oxygen in this atmosphere, duh. <laughs> oh, you're, I think, well, you're getting was, shot. Was perhaps not the best place to go. Right, they're shooting you. Yeah. Ow. Maybe something in here. Nope. Oh. All right, let's move on. Are there like items you can pick up? No, no, no collectibles or anything. Just those holograms okay. so far. Uh, did you start out with both the guns? Uh, no. Okay. Uh, you start with just this assault rifle. Uh, looking at the trophies, there's at least a couple more guns. Maybe three. Holy shit! Good. I would assume some kind of long-range weapon, maybe. Maybe uh, some kind of explosive gun. Yes, I sure hope so. Oh god. Ah. I think that's very far away. If only you had some sort of rifle that could snipe him. Yes. Perhaps a zoom function. Just walk towards him and it'll, it'll zoom in in real life. 
Uh, you know what's something that's cool about this game is that it finally made me understand what a holographic site is. Oh. Like, like, I mean, you've been playing Battlegrounds, you know what those are like, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Like, I've never really understood what the difference was between a holographic and a, like a, red, uh, dot. a red dot. Like, yeah. in, a, in a game on a TV, they look exactly the same. But in 3D, I can tell, like, there's depth to this to this reticle. Yeah. I don't know if that plays No, on it the totally TV. does. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but when you hold it up to your face, it looks, like, actually super awesome. <laughs> like, like the closer I bring it to my face, the, like, the farther I can see the, the sight, like, telescoping outward. Right. It's actually really cool. It's like it's real. It's like you're there. I know. Right here. That's all I'm totally... Oh, God! Oh, jeez. <laughs> Kill it. That seems bad. Whoop. Oh, ah. it's a guardian. You gotta kill it for ancient arrows. Yeah, I need, I need some ancient arrows. Yeah. Are you dead? Nope, you're not dead. All uh, right, so there's yeah, there's attachments on these guns. It's got the grenade launcher and there's a rocket. Jeez, this guy takes some damage. Dead. Ah! Uh, not cool. Good thing it can't melt through that uh, wall. Robot lasers can't melt, melt steel beams. That's right. Oh, wormhole explosion was an inside job. <laughs> Dude, what the hell? Man, it's a boss, it's, man. Oh my oh, god. Oh no. Dude, is this thing killable? Are you dead? Like this this thing has absorbed more damage than the actual bo first boss that I that I beat right before this. Well at least it starts you right here. Yeah. Let's try that again. I wonder if you just have to run from that thing. Ah! Uh, uh, try this again. Whoop! Ouch. I don't feel so good. Okay, all better. Whoop. I can shoot him through this hole. Yeah. Out. Engaging boss battle. I don't know if this is even a boss. The first boss, like, was very obviously a boss fight. Did it have a big health bar and a skull uh, next to it? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Going on up here. Oh. More dudes to shoot in space. Yeah, that's kind of what you do in this game. Holy oh, shit. Oh, that's hide. bad. Oh. oh, hey. Okay. Oh, look at that. Nice. Uh, should I uh, pick that up? I'm trying. I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> there we go. That's right. <laughs> you have to do that. You have to literally go like that. <laughs> Advanced sight. Yep. It features semi-automatic fire with a three-round magazine. The advanced sight indicates when an enemy is targeted. Oh, that's cool. A little homing. Yeah. Wow, that's sniper. pretty neat. I'm not going to lie. All right. Snipe. OK. All right. <laughs> that was cool. Yeah. Oh shit. Uh oh, this look out. Bad. Look out. Yeah, I see it. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Here you go. Yeah. I'd say work work the angles. Oh crap. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Ah. That looks like a there we go. That oh, looks like trouble. Yeah, this is oh god, there's another one. Shit. I gotta go. Don't shoot me in the back. I need cover. It's dishonorable of a robot to shoot a man in the back. It really is. Isn't that one of Isom uh <laughs> That's one Isom of the three law. laws? Yeah. Oh, where's that guy? Shit. I take this one out first. Whoa. Shit, one of these guys are everywhere. There you go. 
Take your time. Nah, dude. Ah! <laughs> Holy shit. No sprinting. No, I am sprinting. It's just not that much faster. A little bit faster, shit. Fuck me. This fucking... Oh no! What happened to my... Oh god, I think I lost my assault rifle. Oh, you traded it for the precision. I think I totally did. I didn't realize you could only have two weapons at once. Yeah, it seems that one would be more useful than a shotgun here. Yeah, totally. That sucks. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Shotgun is kind of useless at this range. It seems tough. Yeah. Uh, there's definitely a difficulty spike on this level. It's been super easy up to here. Uh, but I'm, all these robot enemies I'm seeing for the first time. Looks like I've got them. Oh, well, hey. And you can't just run past these guys? I uh, think you take too much a, damage. Probably a bad idea. All right, that thing does what? some damage. Yeah. That was like, what, five, six shots or something? That was way more than your rockets were doing earlier. Yeah, totally. Ah, uh, where's that crate? I wonder if I can get my assault rifle back. Oh, the shotgun is so good on the bugs, though. Uh, uh. Kind of a bummer that it limits you to two weapon slots. Yeah, I agree. Unless there's something I'm missing. I am a firm believer that the player should feel more powerful as the game progresses. Yeah. Ah, uh, you know, it depends on the game. Ow! Oh boy. That's good. That's good. There we go. Nice. That guy down. Yikes. These guys don't stand a chance. I hope you're right. Oh, they're everywhere. Look out. Laser coming at you. Yep. Probably press up Ow. against that wall. Uh, yeah, that might be the thing to do. I wonder if that eye is a weak, weak spot. Shit. No, don't die, don't die. Oof. Here you go. All right. Shit. There ain't enough robots in this galaxy to stop you. That's right. All right, I think we're good. Yeah. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? Got some grenade ammo. I don't know if I can get my rifle back or not. Yeah, it didn't look like it, was it, here? it was there. Isn't this where it was? I think so. Yeah. Huh, all right, well. Shotgun and sniper rifle, let's go. Something feels very wrong about that combination. Yeah, I'm kind of with you. You got no mid-range defense. Yep. Oh. Gotta reload. Oh shit. Ah, the gun. Okay. Easy. These guys are a worse shot than you, so yep. it doesn't even matter. Yep, all good. They don't have <laughs> homing. I just have to be better than them, that's all it takes. <laughs> it's 
like you're gonna go inside a tube. Oh shit! Oh, uh, that's bad. That's yeah. Oh, that's I'm cover. Open. Oh shit! I'm stuck. Oh, oh wow! How'd that look? Uh, pretty cool. Oh, there are like pieces falling off. Okay. Nice. This game really needs a flashlight. This is this is not the same. It looks like it should be a flashlight. Yeah, totally. Because you go through a lot of dark caves and tunnels and stuff like this. Like it would be really cool to just like wave a flashlight around everywhere. Whoa. This looks cool. Huh. This, this is gonna be some heavy Metroid Prime vibes. Yeah, a little bit. Sure. Scan all fragments. Okay. This feels like a boss arena. Yeah, it kind of does. Where were we even? That stuff on the rocks. That's actual. Whoa. You gotta give me a sample. I can make a quarantine inside the. No. I told you we stay on mission. I'm here to find the pilgrim and get us the hell out of here. That guy's all about doing science. She's all about getting the hell out of here. I think I'm on her side on this one. Yeah. Grant. Unless you want us to get stuck here, we have to stay focused. I cannot afford to Whoa. get distracted. Should I shoot that thing? She can. Whoa. Uh oh. That may have been bad. Bad ending. Where'd it go? I heard a robot sound. I think that was my sniper rifle reloading. Okay. Guns are like robots. Yeah, basically. Oh boy. Any other uh, modes to this? So this sniper or rifle or the game? The game. Uh, there's a sort of challenge mode that you can replay the existing levels on, but that's kind of it. Oh, hey. Oh. Seems like once you kind of figure out the enemy styles, it's... Yeah, you totally figure out which weapon works best on each guy. Sure. Oh, shit. Go ahead. Ah! What? <laughs> Splash damage. It's bull. Yeah. God damn. Died pretty fast in this game. Your puny human skin. It's true. I think the only time I've died before this level was falling in the pit. The old Boba Fett. I like that your gun shakes a little bit while you hold it. It gives the kind of like, oh, I'm a nervous space guy trying to hold my own against these big robots. I think that might be the tracking. <laughs> well, yeah, I, I, it definitely is a, yeah. is a fault of the VR thing, but it, it adds a little bit of character to your guy. Sure. Ouch. Oh, no. Crap. Oh, it's your... It dumped me back to the shotgun. Yeah. That sucks. There you go. That was cool. Now I don't have an angle on that guy. Oh, hey. Two of them. Yep. Oh. 
probably fine. These things have crazy splash damage on them. Oh, you're not dead. Two more. Okay. One more. That's, that's it. There we go. There it is. All right. Doesn't look like any alternate fire on the sniper rifle so far. I miss the bugs. Yeah? Yeah. You see some bugs? Those are not bugs. Bugs have more character than robots when it comes to generic enemy types. Because I feel like bugs, you know, robots are just robots. Bugs are creatures with feelings and a hive mind. And exoskeletons. Yeah. Space robots are just red malicious lights that have guns hooked up to them. All right, let's see if we can get to the end of this level. Oh. To assist holographic file recovery, please locate and scan all fragments. What was that? Oh, it's... It's a harmonica. One of the engineers used to play it on his rounds. Never knew his name. Guess I never will. He was the blues traveler. <laughs> John Popper, aerospace engineer. Yes. Him and his wife had seven kids. You believe that? Actually, no, I don't. Seven humans from one woman? Poor her. She'll be raising them on her own now. Don't say that. Don't say that. I'm, I'm good, uh, good animations. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Can you pick up the harmonica? Yes. Yeah, it's not bad. Alert. Pilgrim located. Whoa. Whoa. Holy crap. Thank God. They must be inside. Yikes. Partial data recovery. I don't think they're inside. Probably not. Files are available to view. So what do you think? Like, Dead already or know. going to die as soon as you get there? Hmm. I don't know. I have a, I have a hunch about where they're going with this, but. Okay. Uh, there you go. Also, you get one of these at the end of each level. Somehow. And you know the weirdest thing about these soil samples is that the microorganisms what? in here, they have no clear evolutionary connection with them. It's like they're all from different ecosystems. He's hanging out back at base. She's out trying to... Oh, okay. It's like... She's it's out trying to find the other survivors. Of her yeah, out. she's just okay. like walking on her mission. But still never totally scratch the surface. Can you please stop wasting time with that? It's not relevant to us getting home. Oh, no. It's not useful to our survival. If we don't get out of here, it doesn't matter how interesting this place is, no one will ever know. Tensions are so mounting. At the very least, you should be cataloging rations, or maybe... Maybe... It's fucked up. You gotta stick together, man. I know. Solidarity. There's only two of you. <laughs> I'm being an asshole. And you hurt his feelings. Is his last name Moon? Yes. It's a little on the nose. It's okay. I get it. Definitely drew the short end of the straw. I'm usually pretty nice, I swear. Oh yeah? 
It's weird that they get louder when you look at them because it's not really how it works in real life. Yeah, kinda. It's like you're a camera. I see, I see the dome, the heart of the pilgrim. Look. Woo! All right. Yeah. Okay. Not far to go. And they found it. We're gonna get out of here. I'm so happy they're gonna get out of there. Way out of here. Really good performance capture in this game. Yeah. Like, I don't know how much it comes across on the TV, but... Well, those are actual people just doing it in VR somewhere. <laughs> just slap on a PSVR. There you go. Uh, that's kind of the game. Like, every mission has been that. I mean, the robots were new as of the last level. It's been all bugs up to that point, but... Uh, it's, it's very straightforward, you know? Yeah. It's pretty much walk in a straight line forward and shoot everything in the way. And then watch cutscenes, and then repeat. Can you use that uh, gun on other games? Like... Uh, not, I mean, I think, you know, it just came out alongside this this game, so, uh -huh. so no other games yet, but I would have to assume... I'm gonna shoot the moon. That's that thing that guy was named after. Shot the moon. Um, I have to imagine other VR games will support this thing. Uh, let's pop back to the lobby real fast. You want more bugs? Love those bugs. I could give you some more bugs real fast. Yeah, the, there's a... There's also a co-op mode, but, uh... I can just do finger guns. Yeah? Yeah. You wanna just jump in here? Whoa, hello, that's a big gun. I wonder if... Okay, I, I think you have to... There's no matchmaking from the looks of it. I think you have to have a friend to play with. So let's not mess with that. But, uh, and you can also do, uh... You can also do challenge versions of the story levels. Like I said, jump in here and kill a few bugs. Real I fast. assume it's just like oh, this is the weapon select. The same, but no story elements. Hang on, check it out. Yeah, I'm watching you do this in real life, and it's pretty good. It's really dumb. <laughs> it's really silly. <laughs> you just shoot with both your fingers to change your guns. Oh. Oh. Is that Ed 209? What's that next to your uh, couch? Oh, well. All right, uh, this, so is, this is the hot strat segment. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, so for the challenge mode, whoa, boy. For the challenge mode, they slap a, uh, like a combo system. Okay. Uh, And a, oh, and a timer. Where's the timer? It's invisible. Oh. Uh, but you, you hit this, oh boy. This is actually kind of awesome, just running through this as fast as you can and just shooting everything along yeah. the way. Yeah, this, se this seems way cooler. Whoa, I mean you could, whoa. You could play the story this way if you wanted. Yeah. Something about the, the quicker pacing makes this seem... Better. Yeah, well, you've definitely, obviously you've got the extra time pressure just for the score. Yeah. Or, I mean, the, the scoring and the timing and stuff. They rate you on accuracy and, and time and all that stuff uh, at the end of this. Let's see if I can just fly through this level. Whoa. So yeah, I would love a flashlight right now. Flashlights don't work in space. I guess not. <laughs> That's science. They use solar energy, but you're too far from the sun. Look at those numbers. Ah! Ah! Fucking bugs. Oh shit! Oh, oh god, I didn't know those guys do damage when they explode. <laughs> Bleh. Uh, anyway, yeah, that challenge stuff seems kind of cool. Hey, first place. Yeah, I'm the best in the world, except not so much. Um, this game's okay. Like, it's not, there's nothing mind-blowing about it other than the fact that it's in VR and you've got this gun. Yeah. But that's kind of enough. I could see it being a really cool pickup if there's two, three, maybe four games that they, work they use well this with gun? this gun. Yes, that's the thing. Like, yeah, I would, because I, it's what is it, eighty bucks for the for the game and the gun? Yeah, I would maybe, if you're a little wary, hold off. That's really fun. 
Also, so is this. <laughs> uh, yeah, if you're, if, you're, if you're not sure you want to play a very simple first-person shooter by itself, maybe wait and see if other games come out with support for this thing, but it's kind of cool. I've played worse. <laughs> That's my Put it on the, the virtual box. That's my professional opinion. Farpoint, it's out now. Thanks, Ben. Thanks, Space Brad.